All right, now we're on the other oyster farm. As you can see this one goes under the water a little bit later. So we just run through the middle of it and grabbed a handful. Joe, I slept in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I always sleep in. Um, and so we grabbed a handful and see how these ones are coming on. We cleaned this farm up last year and so hopefully they'll be pretty good. So out of the handful, that little pile there is the ones for harvesting. They're not quite ready, a little bit, little bit um, young. And then those are the ones that you put in the net bags to on grow. They're probably ready at the end of the year. And that's the waste, so it's actually not too bad. And if we have a look at the oysters there, that one there is not too bad. It's a little bit of fat to it. That one there's not too bad, not, not as much fat. And then that one there's got a little bit of green still on it. Uh, and the green that means it's not quite ready. So this farm will probably be picked halfway through the season through to the end of the season. Mound of oysters over there, We've got to clean up one day. There's exactly three million oysters on here, we know you count every one every Yes, day. yes, I don't, I've seen Arapita down once a week to count every oyster. <laughs> <laughs> That's a bugger when he forgets halfway through, too. I can't take any home. Yep, but no, this is this is my original farm. So, the big yellow barge that we're building has got to come down here and do a lot of clean up. All these sticks and all these shells along here, they all have to come out. So we looked at rebuilding it, but it's just not worthwhile. It's, as you can see, it's still out of the water and it should be underwater. Um, tried doing it by hand, but it was just impossible. So we that big old yellow beast down here, Zephyr 4, and we'll do some damage and clean it all up. That should be good. And then if you look back that way, you can see Pahi, or just about see Pahi. That's where we launched the boats from. All right. 